Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show a step by step process how we can easily uh, create or have set up customize your um, invoice template. So let's start. The first thing you want to do is go to top right and then you're going to see the, here custom form styles. When you click on the top right settings and custom form styles. When you're going to be here, you want to go to top right new style and then click invoice. Right then, when you're gonna do it, you're gonna see design here. Design, content, and emails. In the design, you can dive in uh, like with what kind of template you would like to have. Let's say friendly, fresh, modern, classic, every new. I'm going with modern. Then you can simply add a logo. I'm going to upload Baby Yoda here from a TV show. Let's say that this is my logo. Click save. Right when you do it, uh, you can change the size of the logo and placement. Then you can splash on some color. You can edit the colors here. Then you can simply uh, change font. And change the size of it. And then uh, you can change the margins. When you're going to continue, you're going to see content here. In the content, you can edit uh, the header, the form and table and footer. In the header, you can simply uh, edit things like business name. Then you can add a phone number. You can uh, disable email. You can add also your address and website. Right then you're going to have form here. So you can uh, disable for names, form numbers and you can use custom transaction number then you're gonna have like display of terms you can disable it due date you can disable it or enable it right then you can simply click on your a middle part which is table in table you can simply move the columns right as much as you want So that's what you can do. And then when we go further to footer here, you can edit display. You can add deposit estimate summary. And you can also edit the message to customers. When you're going to click also, what I wanted to show you is you can edit the labels and width. Then you can edit the width and label of columns. And you can edit the name. Right, that you can add like date one. So when you got it, you got a footer. And thank you for your business and have a great day. You can add footer text. And then you're going to see emails here. And you can edit too if you want to. So this is how you can do it. And this is the way. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. If you have any questions, ask me down in the comments. When you got it, you can also preview the PDF. And you just click down here on the last step, you can edit the email. And yeah, thank you very much. Have a great day and goodbye. See ya. Mm -hmm.